A combination of three resistors is connected to voltage source. Our task is to point out a resistor that dissipates the maximum power and then calculate this power. So we have two resistors connected in parallel and then they are connected in series with 1.6 ohm. At first we have to answer the question. If we have two resistors connected in series, if R sub I is greater than R sub J, then the same current flows through each resistor, like we have here, and power dissipated is directly proportional to the resistance value. Then a resistance with greater value dissipates greater power. In this case, a resistance of 2.4, but this resistance actually is a equivalent resistance of these two elements. Then, to answer this question, to point out a resistor that dissipates the maximum power, we have to go further. Uh, we have to check this power connection. If two resistors are connected in parallel, like here, then we have the same voltage and uh, across each resistor power dissipated is inversely proportional to the resistance value and the resistance with a smaller value dissipates a greater power. In our case it is 4 ohm resistance. Definitely power dissipated by this resistance is greater than the power dissipated by 6 ohm resistance. Okay, let us then continue calculations to find the uh, resistor that dissipates the maximum power. We have replaced this parallel connection by a single mm, a resistor. Now we may calculate voltages. Um, it is um, a voltage divider. We may calculate these two voltages and then we may find power which is dissipated by 1.6 and power which is dissipated by uh, 4 ohm because we have to check these two resistors. Okay, so power dissipated by 1.6 ohm resistance is this resistance is 1.6 watt and power dissipated by this resistance is 1.44 which means that uh, this resistance is the the resistance that dissipates the maximum power and this power is 1.6 watt. And that way we have completed this exemplary problem.